What's up everyone, it's your boy Nornrad89 here bringing you another video. Today is going to be a physical media video as we are going to dive into this bad boy right here, this Arrow video, big box set of the Warriors, and this is a very special awesome box set that has a lot of cool stuff in it, and this is a monumental film in my life because I discovered this probably at a really good age, and we'll talk about it and stuff and why I like this film so much, so let's discuss this and stick around so we can dissect and review this bad boy. Let's do this. Roll it. So in terms of boutique labels, Arrow Video is just proving that last year, 2023, was pretty much, I think, like their year. They put out so many great releases, and this is one that I, once I saw them talk about the Warriors and that they were doing this, I had to get this one. There's two different versions of this one. There's a original artwork version, which is this version right here, and then they have the new redone commissioned artwork by Laura Greasley, I believe was the new commissioned artwork. That's who did that one. So like I said, there's two different versions of this, but this is a fantastic release with two discs, 4K, both versions of the film. So we got the original theatrical cut, but we also got the uh, alternate 2005 version, I believe. They also have that version on here as well. I haven't dissected or went into this yet or watched any of it yet. This is kind of just unboxing and showing off this release and kind of talking about why it's so amazing. So let's open this bad boy up and start dissecting it. So as you can see right now, we have the slip off sleeve like this right here, like that's just fantastic. And then on the back right there, we have a lot of your specs. So if you wanna see that right there, there's a lot of the, the specs and all that kind of stuff for the release. And oh, it's such a, it's so nice, like the finish on this, you just wanna keep like kind of feeling it up and everything. There's your spine right there. And like I said, this is the one that I wanted because it's the original artwork and I love the, the white, it's so clean. It's a little bit hard to get out of here though because it's it's packed with stuff like there's a lot of stuff in here so let's first open up this double-sided poster right here so let's get this bad boy going which i'm definitely gonna be putting up once i get a frame there we go you see that and then we have the flip side boom boom right there so oh, it's just so cool because this is a film like i said i was talking about in the beginning of the video I just discovered this at the perfect age. I think I saw this on HBO or Cinemax or something late at night, and I had to be like 11 or 12. And this is one of those movies from the 70s that has a certain vibe about it. And this is the 100-page booklet that has writings on the movie and stuff by film critics and everything. Just oh, fantastic booklet. Really hard now booklet. Look at that. So fantastic. Like I said, I discovered this at a very young certain age <clears throat> and this is such a different unique style movie as it's just so gritty it's so raw and it just oozes new york atmosphere and the reason i got obsessed with this movie is my family my mom my grandpa a lot of my aunts they're a lot they're from new york that's where my family's from back east and they moved out here to new mexico in the 70s which was kind of funny they actually moved out here i believe in like 77 so like right around the time when this movie <laughs> was about to come out and like I said, discovered this movie on Cinemax, HBO, and like I said, the fact that it oozes New York atmosphere where it's about the <clears throat> this gang, the Warriors, who are framed for the murder of Cyrus, who's a really high evolutionary kind of gang leader guy who ends up getting shot at this huge gang meeting. The Warriors are framed for it and they have to get from the Bronx back to their home in Coney Island in one night while they're basically on the biggest hit list of their life. They're number one top dog. So every gang in New York is after these guys. So it's it's a really fun, gripping, you know, movie that just gets to you. Also, what's fun, look at this. It comes with cool stickers, decal stickers for the gangs. So it has all the gangs' names, like the Punks, the Warriors. Look at this. I was like, oh my god, I can't wait. The Orphans right there, the Orphans. That was one of the gangs that I love, the Orphans, man. Like, when they show up in the movie, like, that's so cool. Like, look at this. Like, Arrow Video doesn't have to do this stuff, but they, they love the collectors so much, and they care about us that they do these awesome things. And here's some shots from the movie, too. Lobby cards. Boom. Oh, look at those guys. Look at those beautiful bastards right there. Like, this film, it just, look at this. Look at the shots, like it's so good. Like this movie, 
is just it's raw it's real like if it, even though it's a movie you know it's a movie when you're watching it like when i saw it at such a young age i just was like damn this is what real acting and storytelling could be like this you know what i mean i was around like I said 11 or 12 and this is one of those films that showed me like oh this is what acting and storytelling can do this is what it can be like and then here's your two discs which this the 4k the first one the 4k disc and then we have the other one that has the 2005 alternate version on it and some special features as well as on that other disc this also has flip work art oh so i don't know why i closed it let's look at the flip art work so we can show off that because i'll probably leave the flip art for here and stuff oh man like i was just so happy with this release for real this is one of those releases that will just always be one of my favorites because of the film it is because it's aero video how much care they took of it there's that other flip work artwork right there so yeah like this is one that i can't wait to dive into and watch it like this is going to be really fun and i get to show my wife this movie because this is a movie that i think she's seen it but she doesn't really remember it so it's going to be a lot of fun returning to this movie with my wife i'm debating if i want to keep the stickers in here all nice i kind of want to put them on my my shelf right here like this shelf right here i have horror stickers all around it i got stickers on the top stickers on the side so i might just start filling this up with all these collectible stickers and stuff and then like when i die i'll pass this down to my kids and this will be like the special shelf <laughs> with all the stickers and everything on it or something but oh yeah this release i highly recommend this this was i believe this was 45 bucks I think it was $45.99 and the, like with shipping and everything and all that stuff is how much I paid for this and I, I don't even regret it. I don't regret a single freaking solitary penny because this is amazing and I can't wait to like I said dive into this and watch the 4Ks. I was a little depressed. The reason I didn't watch it yet is because uh, for Christmas I got we, me and my wife we got our, ourselves a 65 inch 4K QLED TV. And when we opened it on Christmas Day and found out it was cracked, the delivery guys, because we didn't open it till Christmas Day. That's what sucks is I should have opened it. It came like a few days before that. I should have opened it before that just to find out anyway. But we waited till Christmas to open it and stuff so we could open our gifts with the kids and shit. And that's when I found out that it had a crack in it from the delivery. And I was like, oh. so now we're waiting on the replacement that should be here January 3rd. And that's when I'm going to be, like I said, when I'm off, the first night I'm off, I'm going to be watching everything and all the special features on this bad boy. So I'm really excited to dive into this release. Like I said, it's got a lot of stuff on here. Let's start rattling off some of the stuff that are on here in terms of content. Exclusive new 4K remasters of both the theatrical cut, 2005 alternate version of the film, the original camera negative, supervised by Arrow Films and approved by director Walter Hill. The 4K Ultra HD and Blu-ray presentation in Dolby Vision. Theatrical cut pre presented in the original aspect ratio, the 185 by 1 for the first time on home video. And original mono compressed audio, or uncompressed mono audio. The options for the theatrical cut also they have the option for the english subtitles for the deaf and hard of hearing so that's really fantastic that they include that as well the 100 page bound booklet that we saw for real that was awesome the newly commissioned artwork by laura greasley the double-sided fold-out poster so there's so much that you just get in here the six postcards everything then on the second disc or no the, not the second disc the next part we got the New audio commentary by Walter Shaw, which is the author and of Walter Hill film War Stories, a new interview with director Walter Hill, A Whole Lot of Magic, a new roundtable discussion with film, in which filmmakers Jim Olson, Lexi Alexander, and Robert D. Kurskwitz, sorry if I messed up that name, <laughs> discuss their love for the Warriors and the work of director Walter Hill. Battling Boundaries, a new interview with the editor of the film. Then we have Gang Style, a new interview and costume designer. Armies of the Night, a new exclusive look at the costume designs. Photography from the archives by the designer. Sound of the Streets, interviews with the composer and music and stuff like that. So there's a ton, a ton of stuff. The Warriors came to be featuring interviews with the producer Lawrence Gordon and and James Remar, editor David Holden, and writer and director Walter Hill. Battleground, an archival extra in which director Walter Hill and the assistant director David Ososna look back at the difficulties of shooting on location in New York City. So that's another fantastic thing is this is a true New York film because it 
is about New York and it's filmed in the actual mean streets of New York City. So that's why I love this film so much. And The Way Home, an archival extra focusing on the look of the film and contributions from the director of photography, The Phenomenon, an archival extra featuring director Walter Hill and the cast of The Warriors, the theatrical trailer and image gallery. So blah, 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 blah. did you hear that just rattling it on? That was like two minutes what worth of actual new stuff on here that I can't wait to dive into. Like I said, I highly recommend this release and totally you guys need to pick this up. And especially if this is a film you haven't even seen, like this is a film that is just very rich with atmosphere and culture and it speaks of the 70s. So that's why I just, like I said, I love this movie so much. So I highly recommend this release. I hope you guys like this video diving into the Warriors Arrow video box set. Please let me know down below in the comment section. Are you considering pick this, picking this up? Did I sell you on the idea of buying this release? Because like I said, it's one that I don't regret a single penny. But thanks for sticking around with me all. And be sure to like this video. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Poke that notification bell. Poke, poke so you're notified anytime I post a video. And stay tuned to the channel because we got 2024. A lot of new content coming. But most importantly, you know what's up. Y'all have a safe and happy day. Peace out.